responding to criticism from KMT presidential candidate Han Guoyu, President Tsai Ing-wen fought back today. She said that Han's pledge to protect the ROC was all talk, as the Kaohsiung mayor has not taken a stance on the ongoing protests in Hong Kong. Tsai's newest video showcases the achievements of a 12-day diplomatic tour. Heads of allied nations and top U.S. political figures show the support for Taiwan in the video. One of them speaks up on the unrest in Hong Kong, highlighting Taiwan's difficult situation. And with everything that's happening in Hong Kong, if you read the news, it's good to have a leader like her in charge in Taiwan. Foreign officials voice their approval of Tsai's administration, but her presidential opponent is of a different opinion. In the three years of DPP rule, the economy is in shambles, the people are suffering and democracy is receding. We are all responsible for protecting the ROC, okay? If protecting the ROC is protecting a free democracy, why is it that when the people of Hong Kong are fighting for freedom and democracy, no one in the KMT or their candidate speaks up in support of Hong Kong? It's all talk. We think that the KMT nominated someone that went to the central liaison office to endorse one country, two systems. Han Guoyu has not spoken up about the anti-extradition protests. I think he keeps talking about protecting the ROC, but could actually destroy the ROC. DPP officials say that Han's rhetoric is full of holes and wonder whether the Kaohsiung mayor will back up his words with actions.